If you spend more than three hours a day in front of a computer or electronic terminal, you probably have some level of what physicians are calling computer vision syndrome. Dr. Michael Duenas is with the American Optometric Association. It causes uh, fatigue, it can cause headaches, it can cause neck ache, back ache, and it can cause things like diplopia or double vision and intermittent blurred vision. Just have a seat in the big chair. Dr. Rachel Bishop is Chief of Consulting Services at the National Institutes of Health in Washington. This isn't damaging the eyes, it's not producing a disease like we would talk about glaucoma or diabetic retinopathy. It's not a disease like that. It is surface dryness and it's eye strain from focusing. Dr. Bishop says a study showed that people do not blink as much when they are concentrating on a computer task and that causes dryness and fatigue. There's a muscle in the eye that focuses the eye on whatever you're looking at. The computer terminal is typically further away than a book. Okay, and if you're focused continuously for hours, that muscle tires. Dr. Duena says the syndrome can cause low productivity in adults and learning disabilities and low grades among school children. And the fact is, is that even children now are on computer terminals for long periods of time and many of them are playing games and, and other device, using handheld devices that put strain on their vision system. Doctors agree that looking at an electronic screen is different from looking at printed material. Printed material has greater contrast, while electronic screens are more difficult to bring into focus and require more effort. It does have to do with optimizing contrast, optimizing lighting, and decreasing disturbances like glare disturbance can be, you know, that can cause strain. But Dr. Duena says data show youngsters having increasing problems. We're finding now more and more children are becoming nearsighted because of the excessive close work on handheld devices. Doctors say some easy steps can deal with many of the problems. For example, occupational glasses. There's a new sort of kind of glasses that have developed called occupational glasses where instead of the traditional distance glasses at the top, and near or intermediate near glasses below, which is bifocal or trifocal. They put the computer distance glasses at the top because that's typically where we're looking out of our glasses and the reading glasses below. Doctors also recommend using eye drops for lubrication and taking a break every 15 minutes to look into the distance. And one more thing. Make sure that the height of your computer terminal is at the right height. Um, you want it about four inches below your line of sight. So you don't want to be looking up at a computer terminal. You want to be looking slightly down. Although the solutions seem simple, doctors expect computer vision syndrome will get worse as more movies and television programs become available on computer and with the growing number of small electronic devices. This is Sulima Palacio, VOA News.